Well, I have some interesting news. A mere seconds, a mere seconds after we left last time, the Griffonian Empire decided to raise the white flag. It was, it was, it was a crazy ordeal. It was fast, and I, I didn't expect it to happen so quickly, but I guess they were losing core provinces or something. It didn't seem like they were that close to capitulating, but they capitulated really fast. It, it was weird. It's over now. It's, it's okay, and we also can proclaim the Ost Griffonian Empire. Oh, it takes 30 days. <laughs> this is just like when I tried to declare war on the River Coalition, and then I figured out it took 365 days to do that. Well, it looks like we have another decision. Become the successor to the Griffonian Empire. Looks like all we need to do is own the Imperial City. So that makes it desirable to take out the Griffonian Republic. They're about twice as strong as me. They, they, they have a lot of... Oh, wait a second. They're on scraping the barrel. Guys, they're on scraping the barrel with only like, okay. Guys, this might be crazy. This might be very, very crazy. I think we should go to war with them. They're on scraping the barrel with like no manpower. They're on scraping the barrel with no manpower. Oh no, never mind, they have manpower now. Wow, this is a miracle. I just realized we're at 2 million pony power. I, I really have no clue how that happened. We must have got like a ton of core states, yeah. Yeah, we did get to core states. I was just looking at some areas that were colony states, but <laughs> that's a lot of manpower. We, we have, they only have about 500 to 750,000 on scraping the barrel. We're only on all adults serve, which I guess is only 5%, but we have 2 million guys. We're gonna win this. Watch them join some stupid faction or something. Watch them join Wing Barty and then ruin this entire game. That's actually something that's gonna happen. They are the same ideology. I, I, I can't do this. I, I, can't, I just can't do this. You know what? I'm gonna cancel the justification. I can't do this. I can't have this happen again. I really don't know. Okay. Rip. Wing Barty. Wing Barty wants to go to war with Equestria. Equestria. Actually. Do you guys see this? Wing Barty's stronger than Equestria. Not stronger than Equest- well, Wing- Wing Barty's stronger than Equestria, just... Compare- comparing factories, Wing Barty's stronger. Well, they are on scraping the barrel with not that much pony power left. Well, war has started, so... Oh, yep, they're gonna- they're gonna get kicked out. It's gonna be scary to be in a perpetual war with Equestria, though. They're gonna have to be- have to be careful, I guess. I guess I'm moving my troops again because I'm the weaker of the three big powers here. They both have upwards of two. They, they both have tons of factories. My only hope is the manpower game. This is like the Soviet Union right now. I was, I've been, I've been France, I've been Germany, I've been, now I'm the Soviet Union. It's 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 a wide range of play styles here. Okay, Wargle is ready. Things don't look too good, but the nice thing is over most of the border they're taking at least some attrition. They their troops are better laid out now. They were taking like 16% earlier. Uh, I just really hope that we can hold because their manpower is low enough that, well, they just have so many divisions, though. But it's now or never.
the situation here is pretty much completely dire. It's it's kind of crazy how strong they are with all these core states. They're just so powerful. Like even a zero manpower it doesn't even matter. I can't push them at all. I've tried kind of pushing in areas, but it's just like completely well bad example. <laughs> it's just just like it's very terrible. Okay, okay, look at these numbers. You have to see what's going on because it's been bad. I can't push forward at all. I've been fighting for air superiority, fighting for fuel. Oh, speaking of air superiority, it's bad. But look at this, look at this. Look at the casualties. 100,000 of our soldiers have died. 2.63 million of their soldiers have died. It's it's not even close it's an entire different story we still may lose but that's that's an accomplishment in and of itself and i've also noticed that the griffonian republic has a puppet named the griffonian republic and they're in a different faction i thought that was just interesting i, I anyway let's get back to the war well, Wingbardi decided to cancel their non-aggression pact, which is slightly unsettling, but I assume the AI. If it's anything like other mods in the base game, it's just doing that because it can. I hope so, because there's really no hope if they declare war, but without them in the war, without them in the war, things are actually really good right now. Things are amazing. The casualties, they're at 3 million, we're still, we, our casualties haven't even really changed and they killed like another half a million men. It, it's crazy. Throughout the entire course of the war, only one province has changed hands. <laughs> and that's pretty crazy for an entire war to happen and only one province get lost and it's this one right here. And it's a level 1 fort. But <laughs> look at this button right here, yep. We have a nuclear bomb, and we are going to take back our land. We're gonna li we're gonna liberate the small amount of griffins hidden away here. There we go. It also has a lot of medium tanks, and it's one of the highest amount of units on the border. There we go, we've liberated our friends there in this one province. Now we are back where we started. They have no advantage on us, we have no advantage of, on them. The only thing that's different is we've only lost 120,000 troops, and they've lost 3.36 million troops, so... Anyway, thank you guys for watching, this has been a pretty intense... I wouldn't call it a stalemate, just because we've been destroying them pretty badly, but... And thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe, I'm getting close to 100 subscribers. See you guys in the next episode. Bye.